With all the Octoline and Inkling Boy, when, what, what? When you tap for it, the squeezer bottle would jiggle a lot, rather than with the girls it doesn't jiggle. What? So that's why you dropped it, because there wasn't jiggle physics? Do I have to turn on S2 right now? Don't make me turn on S2, just to see what you're talking about. I told myself I'd never touch that game again. Unfortunate. Oh, why am I playing this game? I just want to see what this jiggle physics is. So you're, you're telling me you're looking at the weapon, or you're looking at your character long enough to notice that. And you're saying you dropped the weapon because it doesn't jiggle anymore. Is this what I'm hearing? Only works on boy? What? What the fuck? What are y'all talking about? You also gotta walk while doing it to notice. Oh god, I'm getting baited, bro. Like, <laughs> don't make me go through all this work. This has to be bait. This has to be mega bait. Why wouldn't it have the same the same animation? So, I have to be a boy. I I'm testing something that Echo told me that happens on Squeezer that doesn't happen in Splatoon 3. Okay, so... I have to walk while doing it. And I have to be on boy. That bounce... That little bounce? Wait, what the fuck? Why is it only on boy? What? Wait, what? What? But like, the boy specific thing, when you walk forward, it does bounce. But it doesn't happen in S3. Girls just have better balance? Yeah, I guess they're more accurate, huh? This is like the weirdest- This is the weirdest phenomenon I've ever seen. See, I- I knew it! As soon as I called it. Someone just joined my stream and asked why I'm on S2.